Hey guys, shooting video today. I'm going to show you guys how I um, test a Wii console. Uh, let me grab my chair here. And I will show you how I do a Wii console and how easy it is to test it. Okay, guys? Let me get everything set up here. Okay. What I have here is just a basic monitor down here, okay? Um, nothing's plugged in at the moment, okay? Um, right here, I have a Wii set up right here I've got okay I've got a basic Wii set up uh, let me fix my thing here guys let me bring everything down hold on a minute that way you guys can see everything I'm doing here alrighty okay so what I do is I have a Wii console I got from uh, I don't know half price books or somewhere basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna open it up um, Usually you have a power pack. I don't even test the power packs. I don't test the AV cords. Um, what you're going to do is you have to check the remote. Check the nunchuck. What I do is I test the sensor bar. And I check the uh, the, can the cable, okay? The, uh, the basic console. Okay? So what you want to do is... Uh, I'll show you guys. Let me uh, turn around and show you here. Like I said, what I, what I have is a basic monitor, okay? What you're going to need when you're testing, guys, uh, sorry, this is the old sensor bar I had from the another, another game. Um, nothing's hooked up at the moment. What I have is an HDMI cable, okay, going, an HDMI cable going to the, going to the monitor because this monitor doesn't do AV. Um, what you're going to need to order to test these is going to be what they call a, a uh, Wii, Wii HDMI Full HD. You guys can see that, okay? Full HD converter, okay? And what you do, you're going to hook your HDMI cable to the back of that, and this is going to plug into your Wii, okay? I already have a power pack plugged in. This is just one of my test power packs, okay? So I've already got that plugged in, okay? And uh, what I normally do is I just basically unwrap the sensor bar. This is my monitor, so I don't have to do anything to it, okay? I've got a stand, I ordered a mount for the wall, so, uh, because I'll start doing probably, you know, 10 or 20 of these a week to send them to Amazon. Very simple, it takes less than five minutes, 10 minutes to test them all, okay? I always test the sensor bar, I don't want any kind of return, so I just set the sensor bar up here, okay? I don't Velcro it or anything. What I do is I snap it into the back of this, okay? You got the back right there, the orange. Press it into that, okay? And then what I do is I take my take my AV cable that I have here okay I'm gonna plug this. this is the power thing to go to the Nintendo plug that in it's gonna go right here at the top it's very simple guys very this thing is probably the easiest machine to use okay then you're gonna plug your HDMI thing into the back of the back of the Wii okay Drop my sensor bar I'll have this all done where I have I'll have a one mounted on the thing that way I don't have to do the Wii's you know all this all the time okay and then what you want to do guys is just uh, hit your power button down here or that power or the eject button okay and uh, give it a second it'll it'll pull up okay and what you want to do is make sure there you go okay and what you want to do is I always when I'm doing these guys, I always um, use my own Energizer batteries. Um, pull your skin off, okay? Pull your skin off, okay? Uh, you can put the skin on later. Uh, doesn't matter. And I always go ahead and put fresh batteries in here. These are my, my chargeable batteries, all right? All right. And then what you want to do is every time you get these, you got to have to sync the remote, okay? So what you want to do, this one's kind of kind of greasy or something okay what I do is I wipe them all off just to make sure they you know okay to sync the remote you got this little red button right here okay if you see it right here what you want to do is hit that red button okay this will start flashing and then on the console down here you open the side door okay and you're gonna have a big red button right here okay you hit that and then just hold it like this and it'll it'll keep flashing okay and then it'll go to either the first dot or the second dot, which means it's synced to the, the remote, okay? Very simple, very, very simple, guys, okay? Um, oh, 
Oops, sorry. Uh, turn, the, turn the machine off. Okay, very simple. And another thing what you want to do, I always test the internet, okay? And what you want to do if you're going to do these at all, I have a, I have a hardwired Cat5 going to my router. This is um, an HDMI converter, okay? You plug your HDMI into here. I mean, you plug, you plug your Cat5 into here, and you plug your, your I mean, Cat5 into this, and this is USB on this end. I got this on Amazon, okay? So basically what you're doing is just plug in, plug in your Cat5 right into that, okay? And then this plugs into the, into the USB port on the back of the Wii, okay? So uh, just either port, you got two ports back there for the Wii, okay? And let me see if I can try to uh, expand this a little bit for you. I can't do zoom. Okay, I'm not. I don't have my camcorder. Okay, so what you want to do is press A, select language. You can see how. Make sure the sensor bar is working. Okay, you can see how it's working. Okay, English. There, confirm. Above. This one must be like brand new. Okay, just put. Just press anything. It doesn't matter. Uh, standard. This this must be like completely fragged or something. You can go to your home button, I think. No, this one here, I gotta. Okay, I just gotta type in something. Type in F, or just to, you know, whatever. Okay, then what I wanna do is I always wanna test everything to make sure they all work. So you can do. <coughs> it's having you set it up, I guess, brand new. So I've done this is my fourth one today. Uh, use parental controls? No. Okay, now what you want to do, <coughs> this is your remote, okay? This is your nunchuck. It's just follow the screen directions, okay? What I want to do is basically, the only thing I'm checking is make sure the sensor bar works. What you can see, you can see that my remote's working fine. My sensor, sensor bar's working fine, okay? So all you want to do is basically just go down here to this, okay? Wii settings. Um... What I do is basically, I just check <clears throat> internet. Because you can tell everything else is working. Connection settings, uh, none, wired. I want to make sure the internet works, okay? So now I see the, the Cat5 is running, it's running the internet, okay? Testing connection. It's how it's, this is how simple it is. And what you can do, you can also go back and format the, you can frag it if you want to. I just check the disk management to make sure there's nothing bad on there, pornographic or anything like that. But, but really, these are Wii's, you know, and then what, just make sure that the, um, you want to perform the, the current update for the customer. So just hit yeah and hit accept. Okay, and it'll take a couple minutes, okay? But basically, like I said, all the time on the Wii, on the consoles, you're going to need the power pack, the AV cables, which most people don't use. It'll usually give you this update that says that current update's already done. Uh, hit Wii, Wii menu. Okay. And then you can go back and check. My dogs are under the table, sorry. Um, you can go back, and if you want to check your disk management, you can. There's no SD card in it, so data management save data we blocks there's nothing on here it's completely fragged i think i fragged this one already so um or uh, basically I, I i took everything off okay so now the only thing the only thing left to do is put a video game in so basically when i sell these consoles we sports okay you can see it we sports you're gonna have to put it in this way okay you always want to make sure it loads you because i'm gonna start buying about 20 to 50 of these consoles a week, even the ones that are bad, so I can repair them. And uh, I'm gonna have to clean this remote off and like wipe it off. It's got some sticky stuff on her. And basically just go right here to your little spinning disc right here, okay? You see it's loading up fine, so. Um, hit start, and you wanna plug your nunchuck in just to make sure your, your nunchuck works. Because it'll ask you on Wii Sports, I just go to like, Adequate room play. That's you know, see it, and then make sure it all works and everything. But basically, you don't have to go this far. I mean, um, basically, you know, everything works, so you're good to go. I mean, 
You can go golf, tennis, bowling. You know, you can whatever you want to do. You can, I mean, you don't have to do it anymore. I mean, basically, you know it loads up and everything fine. So all I do now is basically just hit home button, eject the game. Okay, I know it works. Take the game off. Hit my home button. Actually, you can just power it down. And then all I do is basically just, uh, um, basically all I do now is just take my batteries back out, okay? And I set it in a pile for to clean real quick, and then I put them in uh, bags and ship them off, okay?